Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today marks the first day of 12 days of Vlogmas where I'm gonna be posting a vlog for the next 12 days, every single day consecutively. I thought it'd be really fun to do it here on YouTube. This time around last year, I did it on TikTok, but I don't know, I just thought it'd be really fun to do it here and force me to be a little bit more consistent when it comes to posting. So I hope you stick around and hang out for the next 12 days. Today was our big grocery shop day. We went to Costco, Trader Joe's, and Target. We usually do these kind of trips once a month primarily for costco we like to go there for all of our like laundry stuff groceries and just household items in general are really expensive right now with the economy we've saved a ton of money going to costco instead of going to like target for laundry soap and scent beads we even get like our toilet paper and our paper towels from costco and it's just a lot more cost efficient so i would highly suggest that if you are able to do so but today's gonna be really chill i need to put away some groceries i do have a couple gifts that i need to wrap for christmas and i do want to also show you guys some of the christmas decor that we have up this year i'm just gonna go around the house and show you guys everything and kind of go through where everything is from just in case you have any questions anything that is linkable i do have a link in my description box that will consist of furniture items or just anything that's decorative that i can link but the next 12 days i feel like are gonna be a lot of fun i purposely like to do 12 days of vlogmas i mean not that i do it often this is my second go at doing it but same as last year I did it towards the end of December because I like to include it with my birthday, which is on the 23rd. Last year, I stopped it, I think, before Christmas. I'm actually going through Christmas for this one, so I thought it'd be fun to show Christmas morning and all the things that we like to do. I mean, not that we do anything special. We just like to make it really cozy, make a nice breakfast, watch movies, open gifts, you know. But yeah, so the Vlogmas will just be like random vlogs, like evening vlogs or daytime vlogs. If you guys have anything specific that you guys want to see coming up in the next 12 days, let me know in the comments. But I did get a really exciting package right Right now for my birthday i bought myself some desi pair of shades and i'm gonna open them now i haven't seen them it's the drippy ones that she just launched and i'm so excited to finally have a pair for sunglasses i've heard nothing but great things about her brand and that they're really good quality and I've been a Desi stan since before she had babies, before she even had like any of her companies. I actually have a pair of her sunglasses when she did her collaboration with Key. So I'm really excited to open these. So let's open them together. She is just so creative. I love her imagery and just the way she thinks when it comes to her aesthetic. Oh, she's everything. These are sick. Are you kidding me? I'm such a gold and black accessories kind of girl. So this is right up my alley. Can we just take a moment? Wow. These are very good quality. They just feel expensive. 
Oh, bitch. Oh my gosh, Miss Desi, you slayed, girl. There's so many like cool details on this. These are the drippy ones, if I didn't say that already, I think I did. But even on the inside, it says like drippy. These are sick. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait to get my hands on more of her shades. I already have my eyes on a couple more pairs that I want, but these were the ones that I wanted the most. And I think these are the perfect birthday gift for myself. Oh, stunning. Major slay. Now that the groceries are put away, let's get into the Christmas decor. We're gonna start with the living room first. Hi, my queen. Big stretch. Oh, sweet girl. Okay, here's just like a general overview of what it looks like. I'll start over here. I did this last year. I give props to Mark. He found this on Pinterest and I thought it was a really cute idea. It's just this little basket, wicker basket from Home Goods. We did like a little fringe throw inside of it with these like logs. You can actually find them at Target. I think they were like $8 at Target. And then we just have these little fake greenery stems that we found. Don't ask me what plant that is. I wanna say like pine needles, girl, I don't know but we found that one at Hobby Lobby and we just stuck it in there. I think it looks really cute. It gives it like a winter aesthetic vibe. Oh, hello Bonnie. And then the couch um, is from Living Spaces. I do have it linked in my links down below under furniture. I know I get a lot of questions about this couch. It is very comfortable. I will say it sits very low. So if you have a tall person, like a partner that's tall, or if you're tall yourself, uh, you probably won't like this couch because it does sit really deep. This checkered pillow we got from Home Goods like three years ago. And then this little Sherpa tree pillow is from Target. This little green pillow, Teddy Fleece pillow in the back is also from Target. Coffee table is a DIY. It's just the wicker rattan basket from Ikea. And we just flipped it upside down and got a round cut of wood from Home Depot and like super glued it on top. And we've had it for maybe like two and a half years. It's still going strong. This little tray we got from Target maybe mm, two to three years ago. I don't think that they carry this specific one anymore, but they do have one that's similar in the Studio McGee section. That little tree is also from Target. It's from the Bullseye section where they have the items that range from a dollar to five dollars along with that tree too. It does light up, but huh, there's no more batteries in it. So it's just there for the vibes. The stems are from Hobby Lobby and then also the vase is from Hobby Lobby too. I love this vase. I use it actually all year round. I think it ties really well in with the rug. So that's the coffee table. Panning over to the tree. This is from Hobby Lobby. It's a seven and a half foot tree. I don't remember what specific tree it is and I don't even think that they have it anymore because I did have it linked in my LTK, but it's not there anymore. So I don't know if they still have it, but I'm sure they have something similar. As far as ornaments go, the big white ornaments are from Target along with these gold and silver ones. 
And then we just added these little bells. I think we found those also in the Target bullseye section, but I'm sure any craft store would have them. And then this year bows are trending. So we got on the bow trend and added just a few black velvet bows to the tree. And I think it looks really cute, especially at night. I think it ties everything together, which you'll see what I mean. And under all this, um, I don't know if you can see it, but I do have a wicker tree shade. Is that what they're called? Tree shade? Something like that. I have that wrapped around the tree and I like to make it look a little bit more cozy. So I add knitted blankets to the inside of it. And as far as our console goes, this is actually a new console. We got it from Amazon. I love it so much. Stockings are from Target. The little bells are from Kirkland. We have these LED candlesticks that we got from Amazon. The actual candlestick holders I believe are also from Amazon. I did originally have like a plastic garland on here but it just was super stiff and I hated the way that it was falling on this console. So we actually ended up picking up the real garland from Trader Joe's and oh it's so nice. I can't believe I went so long without even knowing that you could get real garland. So that will be definitely something that I do for now on. Don't ask me what I'm doing with the fake garland that I have. I'll probably give it to my mom or a friend that wants it but I think real garland is gonna be a vibe for now on and over here I just have this little book I'm pretty sure this was from like Goodwill and I just painted it white um this little tree is from Target um I think this one is yeah threshold I think they still have these ones I have seen them at Target this is also from Target I think it just launched this year because I did not see it last year but it has a little hole at the bottom. So if you wanted to put one of those LED candles at the bottom, you could. The little tree right here is also from the Target Bullseye section. I think you can find some really good things in that area, so don't sleep on the Bullseye section. And here's a little overview of the kitchen. These little trees, again, from Target. I think this one is actually from, ooh, um, where are you from? Oh, Joann's. I've never really been in Joann's, but when I went to go get some ribbon, I saw that they had some really cute trees. So this one, it's either from Joann's or from the Target bullseye section. Now looking at it, it actually might be from the Target bullseye section. So ignore everything I just said. This little sign we got from Walmart last year, I dug in the trenches to find a link for this and I can't find it. So I don't think that they sell it anymore. These little green towels are from Home Goods. I love the waffle knit. This little gingerbread cutting board is from Home Goods. I love him so much. I think every house has a theme and ours is gingerbread. Let me know down below if you guys have any Christmas themes that you incorporate into your decor. I'm actually really curious. I know my family does snowman. This little tree I want to say was also from Walmart last year. Let me see. Oh no, Hobby Lobby. This one, I have no idea where this one's from, but it might tell me on the bottom. This one's from Target. This one is actually a canister, so it has like a lid that it comes with, but I wanted to use it just to hold the little spoons that we use for cooking, so I took the lid off of that. Towards the front of the kitchen, I have this little gold tray. I want to say this is also from Target. Candles from Home Goods. The little vase back there that's green. That one's from Target. And then this little tree, this one is from Joann's. This is the one that I picked up when I went to go get some ribbon. I thought it looked really cute. I originally had a black tree here and it was like velvet, but I thought it was too much darkness going on. So I like this one a lot more. This little shelf unit is from Ikea. We've had it, I want to say for like three years now. It's held up very nicely. This little letters to Santa is from the Magnolia Home collection, I believe at Target. These little black matte deers are from Kirkland. And then this little tree back here is from Target. That one's also from Target, the little snow globe. And then I always like to use books to layer and style with. Um, and then those little marble book stands are from Amazon. The little matte black nutcracker, I think was from Walmart along with these little houses. Recently added, again, my obsession with Trader Joe's Garland. So we just looped it around the staircase and then I added those black velvet ribbons to it. And I think it looks so cute. 
especially when I have like meetings and I sit in the kitchen on the counter stools. I think the background just looks so good. We didn't do too much in our bedroom. We normally never do. Those green pillows are new. We got those from Target. We've had the rest of the pillows for years now. now you guys might be thinking, this is so extra to have a Christmas tree in your bedroom. And listen, I agree. But Mark wanted one and I couldn't say no because it was on sale. It was half off at Target. So girl math. And to tie in the green theme, we got green sheets from Amazon. They're the most softest sheets. They're the bare home sheets from Amazon. We have them in white too and we use them year round and I kid you not, they are one of the softest sheets that we've ever had besides Brooklinen. I think they're really close Brooklinen dupe. If you're looking for something that's a little bit more affordable. And the last decorated area in the house is the guest bedroom. We did gingerbread theme sheets in here from TJ Maxx and it's so freaking cute. The little gingerbread is also from TJ Maxx and this is so cute, I love it. That's all the Christmas decor that we have. I hope that was a little bit more in depth and longer for you if you're coming from TikTok, but let me know. Just finished wrapping the gifts and that took a lot longer than I like to admit. Wrapping ribbon is no fucking joke. I was quickly humbled and I had to watch like six videos just to figure out how to do it, but I finally got it down. I'm not even gonna lie, I only wrapped like, I think four or five gifts because I ran out of ribbon. So I guess some of them are just not gonna be wrapped. That is a problem for next year. But thank you so much for hanging out. That concludes day one of 12 days of Vlogmas. Let me know if you have anything specific that you wanna see in the next 11 days. Other than that, make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss an upload. And I can't wait to see you in the next vlog. Bye. Thank you.